Okay, Kevin, I uh, figured a video might be a little bit easier for you to uh, look at. Maybe you'll like it more. I just went and picked the bike up. Um, let me just do a quick run around. The only thing I noticed was, and maybe I didn't mess with it, but out on the back, uh, on the back, it's got a little bit of a, a wiggle to it. I don't know if, uh, you know, it just needs a spacer in there, but everything, everything works. I mean, the coaster brake and everything works. But let me give you a... I'm sure you're a bike guy, you can dive in there. Just a quick scan of everything, so you know what you're getting. And here comes my cat, so there's a cameo. Uh, the paint's not great, but it's not too bad. I mean, it's got your typical rub over the bar from the kid dragging <coughs> his foot across there. Chrome, pretty nice. I mean, I know I cleaned it all up. Handlebars are nice. Um, they're kind of a little bit shorter. So I think this is a 74. Not 100% sure on that. Uh, you know, you got your typical marks up on the top where they flip the bike over. Let me flip the bike around. No kickstand, just like um, I had in the picture, just so you're aware. Sorry about the jiggly camera. <clears throat> and yeah, I did uh, redline the tires. Uh, it says premium on it, and I know it's um, they're stamped made in USA, so I don't know if those are original. These decals here, uh, the frame wraps, those are actually ones that I made, so those were added onto it. Uh, you know, you got a few paint chips here and there up there, but everything else seems to be pretty good. A little bit of dry rot on the uh, the front tire and that front tire is a Goodyear uh, wing foot so pretty decent tire but it does have you know a little bit of dry rot cracking there but it's hold they hope they all hold air so anyway just figured that might be a little bit nicer for you to look at looks like the front fender's got a little uh, kick in it so you know, I want to be up front with you. Make sure you know what you're getting if you still decide to go with that. So, uh, talk to you later.